Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be unboxing my BoxyCharm premium box for the month of November. This box came really beat up. It is just completely destroyed, but it's okay. I checked beforehand and everything's still intact, so the products are okay inside. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. It helps me a ton. The theme this month, if you guys don't already know from my previous videos, it is BoxyCharm invite only. Same as last month. This premium box is ginormous, and yet the products take up like a fourth of the box. So I'm a little bit disappointed again this month, just because I feel like my base box was completely stuffed. Maybe I'll show you guys at the end of comparison. I don't know. It's just sizing. I feel like, what are we getting? Like little minis in premium now? I'm gonna go ahead and start out with my first item. This is by Nude Sticks and this was my choice item. This one I am so excited to try. I've heard some really great things about it. I love a good peel, a good exfoliant. This is the Nude Skin by Nude Sticks Lemonade Detox and Glow Micro Peel. The Lemonade Detox and Glow Micro Peel is a skin clarifying at home chemical peel that detoxifies the pores of excess oil, dirt, and pollution while visibly rejuvenating rejuvenating skin tone and texture. It's powered by an enzymatic peeling action of Papain, along with the renewal properties of apple and pomegranate extracts. The Skin Hero is also formulated with vitamin C and lemon peel oil to brighten the skin for a radiant youthful glow. This retails for $34. Super excited. Again, like I said, a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be. It is only 2.03 ounces. I feel like so many people have said great things about this that this is a win for me. And it almost pays for the box. Next item we've got, we're gonna take this out of the bubble wrap. This is the Better Skin Co. Eye Bright Now. It is a glass package, so it feels expensive, and you know, the packaging is pretty nice. Wake up and fight dark circles and puffiness with the Eye Bright Now Serum. I feel like that's a weird name, I don't know why. A single drop provides immediate hydration and helps with the appearance of puffiness and dark circles. Eye Bright Now assists in reducing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. This is a new brand of BoxyCharm, and it retails for $38. The next product I've got is by Girl Lactic, and this is the rose oil petal gloss i've not tried any products from girl lactic before fall in love with this long wearing lip gloss that's infused with natural dried rose petals and a blend of argan oil raspberry seed oil vitamin e and jojoba oil this gloss isn't sticky and is the perfect go-to formula for a glassy finish the formula is enriched with moisture boosting protective ingredients to nourish and repair your lips and it retails for 20 dollars. so let's go ahead and try this out I think the gloss is nice. It is a little bit sticky though. It's like, it feels moisturizing, but it's like that sticky, thick gloss. I don't know how I feel about it. I'll have to try this out for a little longer to see. When I try to pump this back in there, it like shoots back out. Look at that, guys. It takes a lot of force to get this back in there. I don't know how I feel about this packaging. I think it looks really nice. This brush does not want to stay in here. <laughs> I just, I don't like how much force you have to use to put this in here. It does have a slight rose fragrance, which I'm not the biggest fan of rose fragrance in general. I've just never liked it. It hasn't been something I've liked. So if you do like the smell of rose, you will probably like this. And I love the rose petals inside of it. The next product I've got, super tiny again. This is the Riddle Oil Original Roll-On Oil. It's made with simple ingredients of amber and musk the original roll-on oil smells clean and subtle this oil naturally creates a signature scent that is unique to you the original scent is excellent for people who don't generally like fragrance or suffer from fragrance related headaches rest assured when you roll on your original fragrance it is hypoallergenic non-toxic vegan and cruelty free and it retails for $50 it's also a new brand to boxycharm this is eight milliliters i think this is so tiny guys all of these products are like miniature comparing it to the base box in my opinion like you get your money's worth but it doesn't feel like it because everything is so small i'm excited for this all right so i put a little bit on i think it's nice and light i actually like it I'm not big on fragrances. If I do any fragrances, I love men's fragrances and colognes. They just gravitate towards me. I just like that deeper smell, woodsy smell, just something that's not fruity and florally and overly dramatically 
fragranced. It's nice and light. It does smell a little bit more masculine than feminine, and I think that's why I like it, or more unisex. The next product in my box was my second choice item, and this is the Persona Cosmetics Identity 2 Eyeshadow Palette. Ready for a bolder persona? The Identity 2 palette provides the same buttery buildable formula as the original Identity palette with more stunning shimmers and epic color payoff. So this is what it looks like and inside oh looking at this in person comparing it to online and photos it feels a lot more high quality than i was expecting it kind of just looked like meh online and it looks a little bit cheap but in person the packaging is really nice the color story is really pretty and then the pigments look really nice today's video shout out word is lemon if you comment lemon down below in the comments first you'll get a shout out in my next video whatever persona you want to create the identity to is versatile enough for everyday looks, date night drama, and everything in between, and it retails for $42. So let's do a few swatches. Oh, wow. That is nice. Wow, these are pigmented. <gasps> wow, look at that, guys. <gasps> and that gold, so perfect for the holidays. Like I always say with palettes, <laughs> this looks better in person than on camera. They look a little boring, the colors on camera, but... I think in person they're really pretty. I am impressed with this Persona palette. The final item in my box today is by Rodeal, and this is their Blush Drops. It is a liquid blush. Enhance the skin's luminosity by adding a healthy flush of color to the complexion. The concentrated drops provide a buildable, illuminating pop of color to the cheeks, and it retails for $50. Wow, that's expensive for a blush that's only half an ounce. This is a new launch. It is in the shade Frosted Pink. I'm wondering if everybody got the same shade or if there were different shades. I hope there's not too much shimmer in here because I, oh, there is. I like my blushes matte and I don't really prefer, wow, that's thick. I don't really prefer liquid products just because I've got texture, oily skin, large pores. I got everything. Look how thick that is. So if you guys are going to use this, you really just need a tiny, tiny dab of it. Otherwise, you are going to be looking like a clown. It is very, very thick. I feel like it kind of feels like a moisturizer. It actually feels really nice on the skin this is what it looks like so it feels nice when i rub it in but i feel like this is intense i feel like this is way too intense for me but it says on the back these are concentrated drops which is very true but it says it provides a buildable illuminating pop of color to the cheeks how is this buildable like who would want to build more on top of that that was a lot of color and i do like to pack on my blush a good amount of the time i'll try it out i'll test it out some more and get back to you guys on this one because this one I'm a little bit iffy on. The total retail value of my box is $234. I think it's a great value. You pay $38 now a month plus tax. Let me know your thoughts of this box and this variation down below. This is variation C211201-PM. I would also love to know what you guys got in your boxes. So let me know. Today's video shout out goes out to Gabby Dawn. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you guys want a shout out in my videos, make sure to watch the entire video and look out for the shout out word. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button and turn your post notification bell on so you guys are updated every time I post a new video. Love you guys, bye.